When Kylan Mark Hortacrax went off to kindergarten, he was ready. But I wasn't. He was my firstborn, and I was a stay-at-home mom. I knew I'd miss him horribly. But Kai loved absolutely everything about Whittier Elementary. He adored his teachers. In first grade, Mrs. Godwin went out of her way to send me this letter, telling me what an incredible classroom leader Kai was. In fourth grade, Mrs. Teeters chose only Kylan to go down to Ohio State for a presentation to doctors and researchers. We were so proud. And he was involved in countless clubs and activities activities. He was elected mayor of Biztown. He was named the prestigious James Captain and was selected to the district-wide leadership conference. But most especially, Kylan had a blast with all the friends he made. Because we wanted Kai to start meeting people he'd eventually go to high school with, we moved him out of the district, and he went to St. Catharines for middle school. He seemed to adjust well. He was even elected to student council and became the vice president of the council the following year. Kai's grades were great, too. He received excellence in academic awards. And the thing that was neat to watch, too, was seeing him play sports for his school instead of just playing on summer travel teams. Oh, and who could forget, as an eighth grader, Kai was brave enough to do this for a class oh, assignment. You inspired all those believers who once hid. You inspired all those believers who once hid. <laughs> From St. Cats, it was time for high school, and Kylan couldn't wait to be a Hartley Hawk, where his dad has been an administrator and varsity basketball coach for two decades. In fact, Kai was actually the team's ball boy for years. Well, because of his leadership skills, Kai was named to the freshman 15 and was a house captain every single year, along with a mentor group leader. He was continuously on the honor roll and was even named Student of the Year in his chemistry class and English. Even more impressive, he was able to keep up those good grades while playing two sports all four years. Good job, Kai. His sophomore season, the baseball team won a district title, and Kai earned the number one pitching performance award. And then his junior year, the basketball team won a district title. But one of the most memorable moments came his senior year. Kai hit several key shots to help his dad get his 300th win. And chances are he'll also never forget hitting four three-pointers against the sales and beating them on their senior night or pitching the one and only immaculate inning in Hartley history. And we'll often remind him of the times he did this. Wow, it's been an incredible ride. Kylan has grown and changed so much through the years. I'm so sorry, Kai, that you didn't get the ending that you wanted, but your next chapter is about to begin, and you'll have the chance to write your own ending at Otterbein, both in the classroom and on the baseball field. It's time for this hawk to become a cardinal and soar through this next phase of life. We love you, Kai.